Okay. okay, so here we are going to Smashville in Wave 2 over the Team Air Pools. Wave 2 for those with a Smash here. Smashville Wii U, we have Brado versus Solar, Muted versus Captain Falcon here on Smashville. And I have a co commentator with me for this wave, so introduce yourself, bro. My name is Captain Steel, I'm a DDD main. Okay, so we have, uh, first of all, a nice, a nice down uh, down throw to forward air coming up from Captain Falcon. Also, but it was a percentage lead, even. Now, the uh, thing is about this match is Mewtwo is really light and floaty, which means Captain Falcon will be able to KO him really did easily. Did you know that G uh, Mewtwo is the second lightest character in the game? What, next to Jigglypuff? Only light, only heavier than Jigglypuff. Wow, that is light, but... Th that, that is very light. Yeah, but to compensate for that, Mewtwo can hit like a goddamn track, like a goddamn he, train. His smashes do hit very hard. So we got we got a hard hitting smash against a slightly heavy opponent. Oh, the knee! The knee! Oh, the knee. Ooh, okay, so could we go immediately with a sweet spot in the in the air from Captain Falcon taking a very early stock there? He's got yeah. almost the entire stock yeah, to play around. Well. Mewtwo needs to KO Captain Falcon ASAP or gimp him so he can actually pull this back. But yeah, but he's now been lapped. The, the this, percentage is even again. Now, Falcon playing very dominantly right now. Yeah, this is, he's been lapped and could be about to. Uh, could be about to lose this, but I'm not. I'm not willing to count anyone out just yet. Not to boost back onto the stage there with an uh, upper aerial punishment by the Mewtwo here, using his focus to his advantage right now, getting out of Captain Falcon's range. Good use of the air. Yeah, it was a very nice air right there, catching Captain catching the Falcon off guard. And there's Mewtwo's solid recovery. He still, he still had his side B and his up B to recover with there. But can he got to the platform easily. Can you use the side B to recover? Oh yeah, the side B is his best, like one of his best options to recovery. When you're off stage, as long as you haven't used your second jump yet and you've still got upward momentum, um, you can side B and it will launch you quite far really actually. So it's a bit like Mario's cape in that regard. It's better than Mario's cape in that regard. Right then. Uh, it's just like the side Oh dear, the, the, gra the down grab to the up air takes it for Captain Falcon. Game one, two stocks. Ooh. Taking that very convincingly there. Yeah, as we say, the uh, the thing is with Mewtwo, very light, easy to KO, but in return can hit like a dump truck. But so can Falcon. Which is why this matchup goes to Falcon really. Oh, we have a chain. Two, wait, wait. Jigglypuff. The only Jigglypuff. character to light than Mewtwo coming out right now. Yeah, but let's not forget Jigglypuff in the air, which is where Captain Falcon tends to be. Jigglypuff's air game is yeah. ridiculous, and if, if Jigglypuff can get Captain Falcon off stage and just gimp, 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 it's going to be ridiculous. Yeah, but if Captain Falcon can land any of his heavy hitting attacks, she is going to go flying. And I've got to give it to Brado here. I mean, he's using the S tier Jigglypuff skin. So, I mean, how can he lose? The bow. The bow is the best. No, oh, it's there not. Goes our stage I would argue that the Nurse easy. Joy hat is better. Well, you and I can't be friends then. <laughs> Wait, okay. we were friends before? No. <laughs> I would never consider us friends, Mr. Steel. <laughs> Captain Steel to you. So I heard you did well in your pools, but we're not going to talk about that right now. We've yeah, got a no. game going on right now. Jigglypuff playing a lot better this time around than last time. Really throwing up his area attacks to keep Captain Falcon at bay. Putting up the wall of pain with the back air. And the neutral air. Like, and the forward the air. Yeah, the forward air again. And this off stage. Yeah. And the games don't quite come out, unfortunately. The fast yeah. forward forward air. I love seeing those from Jigglypuff because the landing lag on them is very small. And if you also cancel them, you get some music you follow up. However, Jigglypuff is at the advantage on Smashville given the platform and given all the area of attacks can go through. Thing. Yeah, it, it's very good for Jiggy to come out. Oh, that could have been a rest then. He was perfect him for a rest. And he has to have I think back. he's saving the rest. But the rest is something like a counter. You cannot throw that out too often, otherwise you'll kind of read it. The back air was a very solid kill. Just Absolutely. Now. But that, that's the thing with Jigglypuff. She's the lightest character. But in really? the air, she is unparalleled. 25% as well to play around with. I mean, uh, he, he's dominant right now. I don't know. As soon as that hits 40, I'd say that's KO percent for Jigglypuff. We'll, we'll see. We'll see how it comes out. Especially if he gets gimped by that uh, standing up, standing up uh, normal from the, the up tilt. Yeah, that's the one. That's that's the cool. one. The up tilt is very good for gimping. Okay, so whipping the forward smash there. Ooh, there's a forward and smash. And the forward smash again. Very good di there oh. from Vado. But you see, him alive. you see what I mean about Jigglypuff being so light. Yeah. But the and thing is, we have the power to back it up like you would get. Uh, that's me. Thank you very much. And uh, my food has just arrived. Okay, so again we have here. You want to take over the commentary for now? Yeah, sure. Okay, so you have a burger right now, and it's just gorgeous. Okay, dokey. Okay. Right, uh, into the back here for Jigglypuff, who gets caught by the uh, who gets caught by the uh, upbeat, caught by the Falcon kick, and sent straight up like a football. I love the stage bounces there when they just bounce off the stage and launch up. It's my favourite thing in the world to watch. Yeah, you could say Captain Falcon just scored a oh. goal, and you are officially not allowed on the stream anymore. Lol. Get out of here. Ah, oh, funny. But no, a good, good couple of strings into the pound. 
Pound is fantastic for, for breaking shield, so maybe that could be in a... The, the thing about Pound, which always catches me off guard, is that the hitbox stays out for the duration yeah, of the time. Yeah, but yeah. the hitbox stays out for so long that you end up winning into it when the attack's finished. Oh, forward smash for Jigglypuff and... Oh, good really DI. Good DI yeah, Falcon. good DI from the captain. Okay. In the back, back end, there we go. Oh, oh, that was bad DI that, that time around. Yeah, that was a but slow that, KO, that, that was. was cool. Even to 1-1 one, one with so, players. Yeah, it's one all for both players. So do you think do you think you should stick Jigglypuff and do you think the uh, Solar should stick with Captain Falcon? I think you should take Jigglypuff and take it to Battlefield. Oh, that would be neat. Oh, here we go. So they're sticking with their characters, but they are sticking to Smashville. Smashville again. Okay, mm. this is interesting. So naturally, based on what we just saw, we give this matchup to Jigglypuff, but I'm not counting Solo out. No, no, absolutely not. The Final Destination-esque kind of stage benefits Captain Falcon with his speed and power and whatnot, but the platform really adds a dynamic that will play to Jigglypuff's aerial, aerial balance. Exactly. But we've, we've got, it, I'm not, this is dangerous. Being in that position there for Falcon off stage on the platform is dangerous against uh, Falcon. Yeah, but because the sheer power and knockback of her aerial attacks, he could just get you know KO'd very early. He didn't want to be there. No, uh, I, I don't agree with this. It's just, there, nice aerial juggle there from Jigglypuff. And <laughs> grabbing the, the Raptor, Raptor boost. boost. Oh. Jesus. That was that was that was pretty perfect. I, I love that. Okay, so forward smash. Up, oh, here we go. Because Another back air could take Jigglypuff out at this point. But he's got to hit the back air first, and Jigglypuff is showing a lot of damage in the air. Did you see that, that yeah, pivot that, tilt that, there? That, tilt, that was so nice. Okay, so we have... So this Jigglypuff is probably the least aggressive Jigglypuff I've ever seen play, and it's working. That okay. sounds like such an odd, odd, uh, odd statement, an aggressive Jigglypuff. Look at her, she looks so adorable with the big anime eyes and the marshmallowy body. You'd never think aggressive. But fall asleep most <laughs> then she sings, then you'll see aggressive. Yeah. Just don't give her the marker pen. Oh yeah, that's right. I wonder how Captain oh, Falcon would oh, look with a painted on moustache. That'd be wonderful. I actually think that could have been a good uh, rest opportunity with the whiff Raptor Boost, but talking of Raptor Boost... A Raptor Boost kills at 80% on heavy characters. That was Jigglypuff like 110. Yeah. Like, no DI in the world would save you there. As, as we say... That could have been a good down smash opportunity because it actually goes underneath the ledge, which is really odd. Uh, unfortunately, the Invincible Flames are still there. Um, I don't know, he stopped flashing white there for a second. The, oh, the Invincible Flames remain. Um, and especially on characters like Captain Falcon, if you look oh, at their ledge. Good forward there, but DI ooh, saves him there. Yeah, the hurt button. Look, look at the way he's on the ledge. The fact that only his hand pokes out over the ledge there. Yeah, oh, his yeah, nice. His hurt don't stretch out very far. He's very difficult. He's one of the characters that are very really hard to hit on the ledge. 175, 180. Is Jigglypuff uh, actually air. going to kill him yet? He's really doing well at hanging on right now. He need one Jig back air. One back air. Jigglypuff really needs to take out Captain Falcon now, otherwise this is going to be an uphill struggle of epic proportions. I mean, just throwing up neutral airs right now. The neutral air is already back very stable. <laughs> Not even the back bow kills. Oh, Jigglypuff back row doesn't kill. Look at that. The grab on the. Oh, that the was an DI. Oh, but there goes. 2-1 Jesus! 200% rage! That was incredible. That was awesome. Fantastic from both players though. Yeah, but 200% rage. It just goes to show you, even when you're down, you're never out of this game. Exactly. So let's see who we have playing next.